Mouse family, it's Casey Browner presenting EBC Douglasville. Anybody else from Diva out there? Say hey in the comments. Today, I would like to share about mistaken identity. Have you ever been mistaken for someone? I would like to meet my doppelganger if I have one. Or are you mistaken for someone? Cool. That would be awesome. Sadly, mistaken identity is not always cool. Imagine being mistaken for a wanted criminal or accused of something that you didn't do. How do you get yourself out of that when no one wants to believe your truth? That's an ugly situation to be in. Somehow, despite the letters and teachings in the scripture, people tend to mistake Jesus too. It is surprising how we have all these doubts and questions, even when the scripture already supplies all the questions we need. I hope you took time to read 2 Timothy chapter 4, verses 1 through 5, and Jeremiah chapter 17, verses 1 through 10. It turned out people would rather trust their feelings and trending myths than believe the hard truth. Is the truth not cool enough for you? God doesn't find it cool when we mistake him for someone else. He left us a book about himself and the Holy Spirit to teach us. Yet some people would believe anything but the truth and it hurts. I challenge you to get to know God for who he really is. Stop going with the changing myths when the scripture is there to tell you all you need to know. You wouldn't like it if you were mistaken for someone or something you were not, right? Now, you know how God feels. Let's do better. Did you know that on Saturdays we meet for our teen gathering at 11 a.m.? In our gatherings, we dig deeper into the topic of this week's videos. It is nothing like being able to discuss the topic live with your friends. Join us Saturday at 11 a.m. as we have fun and we learn more about God. The link is in the description below and I will see you there.